Bruce Wood Falcons. This week is March 8th through March 12th. Let's go to kindergarten for the letter of the week. Hi, my name is Ellie and I'm here with Millie and Sophia from Mrs. McDaniel's class. What sound does long E make? E. What are some things that start with long E? You sir, eagle, and eel. Thank you, kindergarten. Now to our reporter for the story highlights. Hello, Falcons. These are our high flyers for Servinus. In kindergarten, we have Angelo, Sophia, and Adelaide. In first grade, we have Ben, Afton, and Piper. In second grade, we have Bentley, Harper, and Piper. For third grade, we have Kyla, Mihai, Fourth grade, we have Kira and Vincent. Fifth grade, we have London, Lizzie, and Berlin. Thanks, Falcons. Hi, Mrs. Scano. Will you please review how students should enter the cafeteria? Well, hi, Ellie. I would be really happy to. First, I wanted to start by reminding everyone that our lunchtime is a really important part of the day. We want to make sure that it's as safe and works as well as we possibly can have it run. So the first part is walking into, that, um, into the doors and uh, making sure that we are using our walking feet and also making sure that we are keeping our physical distance. What about the items we put on our tray? So it's really important, Miss Angie, she runs our lunchroom and she's fantastic and all the ladies that work with her on our cafeteria team, they want to make sure that everyone's getting what they need. So we need everyone to only take what they're going to eat. Eat. How should we act when we eat? So when we're in the lunchroom, I know that it's exciting because we're near our friends, but we really need to focus on actually eating first. And so um, the biggest thing that we need to make sure of is that nobody is touching other people's food. And we have had some problems in the past with kids like rolling or throwing food, and that really creates a dangerous situation. Maybe somebody could uh, trip on it. Um, and it's just creating some really uh, hard things for our lunch people to um, support in there. So we want to make sure everyone is just focusing on eating. Yes. What do we do when we are done with our food? Well, we have a great routine where everybody is walking with the flow of traffic towards the lunch um, trash cans. And we want to make sure that nobody feels rushed or um, that they you know, are feeling cramped. So we want everyone to be walking, make sure that they're holding their tray really safely and uh, waiting their turn when it's time to uh, get up to that trash can area. And are we allowed to take food outside? No, that is a huge safety hazard. We know that um, our ladies that are outside uh, watching us play, it's just too hard for them to be worrying about choking hazards because if we're eating and we're running and playing, it's just not safe. So all of our food needs to stay in the lunchroom. Thank you, Mrs. Skeeno. You're welcome, Ellie. Thanks for helping everybody review how we can make our lunchroom the best it can be. Thank you. Hi, I'm here with Kira, Maylee, and Jovi. So every time when your mom walks into the cafeteria, you do this dance. What is the dance you do? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a sweater dance. Can you show us? <laughs> Who invented the dance? Um, Her. Jovi did. <laughs> How, what made you think of that? Uh, I just came to school with a sweater on and Mayla was like, hey, we should make a dance for that. So we did. <laughs> How does that relate to your mom? Well, whenever she comes to the cafeteria, we kind of beg her to do it because she always wears sweaters. So it started with just like our lunch table and then all of the fourth graders started doing it. Now we just do it every day. Hello Falcons. We currently have 74,689 care cards. Keep up the good work so we can find out what our next mystery reward is. Hi, I'm here with Knox. Knox, what sports do you play? I play basketball and football. How long have you been playing football? Two years. Do you enjoy playing on a team or with friends? Friends and team. Do you have any awards? Yeah. 
Thank you. Now for Sprucewood Current Events. Our new trimester starts today. We'd like to welcome all our new students. See you next week, Falcons! Watching the